Hi, I'm Kristen Gartland, Wright State student and intern at the Dayton Demons professional hockey team. The Demons had a successful weekend with a 5-4 overtime win against Watertown on Thursday and an 8-3 win against the same team the next day, putting them in the number one spot in the league. Unfortunately, at the away game on Saturday, the Dashers beat the Demons 2-1 in overtime. At all Demons home games, there are always the concessions in the pub for food and drinks in between periods, but there are also other activities for fans to participate in. I spoke with LaDonna Hudson, president of the Booster Club, about what they do. The purpose is we um, do things for the team. So we have um, booster um, officers in the board. We have people that um, handle all of the stuff for the players, their apartments. So we supply towels, um, dishes, pots and pans, glasses, um, microwaves whatever they need for the kitchen we have. Um, we also do the bedding and things like that. We also do um, parties. We have um, four parties, you know, the welcome party, Christmas party, awards banquet, and a bowling party for the team. Um, we also um, supply food for the bus trips. Um, we do fruit and stuff before home games and different things like that. But whatever they need, we try to accommodate and try to get for them. We have a 50-50, um, so what that is is um, people come up, buy tickets, and at the end, or the third period, the winner is announced when the ticket is drawn, and 50% 50, 50 of that goes to them. The other comes back to the boosters, and that money is used to help the team as well. So that's how, that is our biggest money maker, and that's how we supply the things for the team if whatever they need each year. Another activity that happens in between periods is chuck a puck. A fellow intern, Dylan Kuhn, explained the game. All right, so at the end of the second period, what happens is each fan, or not each fan, but most fans, buys a uh, chuck a puck. And so what they do is they throw it in the middle of the ice and in a bucket. If they get in the bucket, they win $50. If they make it near the bucket, it's like a t shirt. And then, uh, so we do that every and each night. And so, uh, it's good, good things for the fans to get involved, and they love it. Similar to Chuck a Puck, Tossing Bones is a game where once the Demons score their first goal of the game, fans throw the skulls onto the ice and try to get them as close to the puck as possible. Puck shoots in between periods are another activity that select fans can participate in. The participants get three tries to score a goal and win a gift card. The merchandise store is open before the game, in between periods, and after the game. Volunteer Jonathan Smith told me a little about some of the items available for purchase in the merchandise store. We have sweatshirts and jerseys and cups and hats and bags and other miscellaneous demons material including hockey pucks and mugs and stickers. Um, our best sellers are would have to be the sweatshirts and hockey pucks and next after that would be mugs with players faces and names on them demons ticket costs are for adults ten dollars and fifty cents for military seniors and kids eight dollars and fifty cents for youth hockey seven dollars and fifty cents but they must wear the team jerseys to get in for that price tickets can be purchased by phone at 937-723-8461 or in the box office tuesday through friday 10 a.m to 6 p.m or 2 p.m to the beginning of the game on game days Hera Arena is located at 1001 Shiloh Springs Road, Dayton, Ohio, 45414. I'm Kristen Gartland. Thanks for listening. Be sure to tune in next week.